Russian defense analysts and bloggers have taken notice of a potential new development in Moscow's military arsenal, specifically the D-30SN ammunition. This speculation arose after a photo appeared on a Telegram channel, showing a Su-34MHO aircraft carrying two of these bombs. When comparing this novel aviation projectile to its existing counterparts, the UMPB stands out by offering superior range over the traditional Russian fab bombs, which aren't designed for planning operations. Observers highlight that, unlike the standard aerial bombs, this new Russian defense technology boasts enhanced aerodynamic characteristics. Experts highlight that the D-30SN can achieve an operational range of up to 120 kilometers, though this figure is under optimal conditions. Just for comparison, aerial bombs retrofitted with UMPC modules can hit targets up to 60 kilometers away. Based on these photo publications, it's evident that the Russian military industrial complex has now transitioned to the mass production of guided aerial bombs. These bombs are tailored for precision strikes on near-front areas and no longer necessitate additional adjustments by airport technical staff. The selection of the bomber isn't arbitrary either, as Russian analysts point out. The Su-34 HBO series fighter bomber has received extensive modernization aimed at improving its bombing capabilities. Russian defense experts note that these upgrades include advanced targeting systems, enhanced avionics, and strengthened structural components to support a broader array of precision-guided munitions. The Su-34HBO has undergone significant modernization to boost its combat effectiveness. This includes the integration of advanced radar and electro-optical systems, which enhance targeting accuracy. Additionally, its communication systems have received an upgrade, ensuring better coordination with both ground and aerial units. The aircraft also benefits from new software designed to improve bomb-dropping accuracy, making it more efficient in a variety of combat scenarios. This ensures that the Su-34HBO can deliver both conventional and guided bombs effectively. The D-30SN glide bomb and the FAB series of aerial bombs serve different operational roles, which is evident in their design and functionality. The D-30SN is a precision-guided glide bomb featuring aerodynamic surfaces that allow it to glide toward its target from high altitudes. This capability enables the bomb to be released from a considerable distance, thus enhancing the standoff range and minimizing the risk to the launching aircraft from enemy air defenses. On the other hand, the FAB, Fragmentation, High Explosive, series, which includes models like the FAB 250 and FAB 500, are unguided bombs. They rely on gravity for their trajectory and feature a straightforward design focused on delivering a high explosive payload with minimal control surfaces, ideal for general purpose bombing. When it comes to systems and sensors, the D-30SN stands out with its sophisticated guidance technology. This includes both satellite and inertial navigation systems, providing accurate targeting over long distances. Additionally, mid-course correction sensors and target homing capabilities further enhance its precision. On the other hand, the FAB series of bombs are far simpler, relying solely on the launch platform's accuracy and altitude for deployment. They lack onboard sensors or navigation systems, making them dumb munitions.
The auxiliary packages and accessories are another key differentiator. The D30SN benefits from auxiliary kits, such as extra navigation modules or data link systems for real-time guidance updates, which boost its operational flexibility. Conversely, the fab bombs are straightforward in their design, usually without auxiliary systems or additional support beyond standard mounting equipment on aircraft. This simplicity confines them to conventional bombing roles, without the precision enhancements seen in modern guided munitions like the D-30SN. In today's military landscape, the closest American counterpart to the Russian D-30SN glide bomb is the GBU-39B. Both the Russian D-30SN and the American GBU-39 B leverage precision-guided technology and share the ability to glide toward targets, yet they differ in their systems, warheads, and operational range. These bombs are launched from aircraft at high altitudes, allowing them to glide over long distances, thereby reducing risk to their launch platforms. The D-30SN employs a dual navigation approach with satellite-based GLONASS and inertial navigation systems, akin to the GPS, INS guidance system of the GBU-39B, ensuring precise targeting over extended distances. When it comes to warheads, the D-30SN is armed with a conventional high-explosive warhead designed for accuracy against hardened and surface-level targets. On the other hand, the GBU-39B features a smaller 250-pound blast fragmentation warhead engineered for deep penetration, making it particularly effective against underground bunkers or fortified structures. This design gives the GBU-39B an edge in targeting heavily reinforced sites, whereas the D-30SN excels in more general-purpose strikes.